Hi friends, this is Dr. Abdek. I am Chintana Wala. Today I will discuss one of the very important remedies. A remedy used for urinary complaints and bladder complaints. And I will discuss today whatever symptoms clinically I have seen in my practice and I have got good results. The remedy which I am talking about is Petroselenium. Now Petroselenium if you have seen in your Mater Medica or in your repertory, it has lot of symptoms in related to urethra and the bladder. Now I will discuss some of the very important symptoms clinically verified in my practice and, I tha- and has, that has given me a lot of results in this type of complaint or HA symptom. First of all discharge. The discharge from the urethra is acrid and corrosive. This is a very important symptom of petroselenium discharge are very acrid and corrosive. Normally in this complaints we normally prescribe remedies which are more uh, chronic that is urgentum nitricum or mercor or natrumu but petroselenium is also very important remedy when the discharge are very acrid and corrosive as you go further in petroselenium the discharges from the urethra is albuminous now this is a very important remedy for whether when the urethral discharge is albuminous in comparison with cantharis and nitric acid these three remedies are the very important remedies of course most of the cases where the discharge from the urethra is albuminous these three remedies should cover the first i give importance to petroselenium sometimes don't always look for the acridity and the albumin discharge sometimes in petroselenium the discharge is clear and transparent it is a very clear and transparent or it is also called as colorless discharge there is no color in the discharge and when the discharge is absolutely colorless with petroselenium one remedy should compare that is nitrumuri and cantharis now if you see the metramedic of petroselenium in relation to urethra complaints you will find these remedies like cantharis or nitric acid nitrumur coming very close to petroselenium that's why this remedy sometimes if it is indicated also not given because of the comparative chronic remedies which come with this again the discharge sometimes are milky from the urethra in petroselenium and especially if the discharge is milky after urination then you must think about petroselenium in comparison compare it with natrumur compare it with copaiva or lachesis again natrumur comes with petroselenium and the discharge is normally very chronic the patient comes to you with some other symptoms and when you ask symptoms of the urethra says now this has been so chronic that i have white discharge after urination from the urethra and then you find out the remedy is petroselenium so chronic discharge is chronic covid discharge from the urethra after urination think about petroselenium or lachesis or sepia which are again very much indicated in these type of complaints now there are some sensations where uh, in the urethra as in whom it is so important to understand the sensation in the urethra the patient feels uh, a dropping from sensation you know something is dropping from the urethra while passing so this is a very important symptom while passing urine there is a sensation that something is dropping from the urethra or you can say that there is one symptom and there is formication in the urethra there is crawling during urination now this is again a very very important symptom because formication or crawling during urination in the urethra there are only three remedies which i have used in my practice in most of the cases and that has given me very good results petroselenium compare that with phosphoric acid and ignisia amara these remedies have a very very interesting symptom that is formication or crawling during urination and this symptom the patient will uh, tell you very very precisely and very very clearly in your case taking and of course there is sometimes uh, there is pain, biting pain in the urethra and the patient uh, basically has a lot of pain and biting pain during urination so pain formication the sensation these are also very important and there is one symptom which is very very uh, important in petroselenium where your anatomy has to be very good that it is said that there is a cutting pain in the urethra especially at the fossa navicularis especially after urination now there are only two remedies which are very important the first important remedy and the most important remedy is petroselenium and the second is definitely thuja so some anatomy if you remember this fossa navicularis please go home and check in your books of anatomy and you'll see understand how petroselenium works in this complaints as you go further then see there are a lot of other symptoms of petroselenium but these symptoms basically are verified in my practice and have got a good results 
Now, uh, one symptom which is very close in petrosilinium, and you will be confused that I have seen lots uh, persons giving some other remedies, but it is said that appetite is increased in general in petrosilinium, but vanishing on attempt to eat. In little humble sakte ke bhai, patient ko bhook bhot lag rahi hai, but jab khana khana shuru karte hai, to appetite chale jati hai. और जब भी ये सिम्टम वेन एवर वी फाइंड दिस सिम्टम वी नॉर्मली स्टार्ट थिंकिंग अबाउट लैकोपोडियम दैट फ्यू मॉटफुल फिल्स ऑफ द बट दिस इज बेसिकली वैनिशिंग ऑन अटेम्प्टिंग टू ईट अटेम्प्टिंग खाना खाने के टाइम पे पहले ही एपरेट चली जाती है वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रेमिडी पेरोपेट्रोसिलियम एंड वन मोर इंपॉर्टेंट रेमिडी दैट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड दैट इज सिलिशिया सो माई डियर फ्रेंड्स दिस इज समथिंग वेरी क्लिनिकल वेरीफाइड सिम्टम इन माई प्रैक्टिस विच आई हैव सीन इन पेट्रोसिलियम So if you like this video do share and subscribe thank you